It's pretty early in the morning on Saturday. Um, <clears throat> I thought I would let you know what I'm up to and uh, so you can see the process a little. Um, basically what we're going to do is we're, we have a photo shoot scheduled for today. The purpose of the photo shoot is for the shop for the holidays and for Christmas and for all the fun things that we have. Um, the one new thing that we're adding um, as far as for the photo shoot goes is we have these um, really awesome historically inspired jewelry uh, that's just going to be around for the holidays. So this is um, one of the reasons for the photo shoot today and then this is the third one right there. So um, they're really beautiful. They're for on your gowns, for the fronts of your gowns, for your hair. Um, for the 18th century and some can even be used for the 19th century but um, the one thing that I wanted to just go over with you is uh, my hair is pretty short yet which is why I haven't really done a lot of videos um, I've been pretty busy just keeping up with the shop and products and things like that and so that's why you haven't really heard from me but I'm around so what we're gonna do is we're going to attempt to use the bellows that um, Patrick made for me and uh, make it all nice and bright. Okay, well, anybody knows when you powder... Oh, hi, Kira. Good morning. Do you want to say hi to everybody? Here, see? Here's my cat. Say hi! You're not going to say hi? No. Okay, well, I need to finish my video, so... You can either sit up here, but you got to be good. Patrick made me a bellows, and, um... We want to try it out and see just how well it covers. I haven't tried a bellows out before yet. So um, when I did my hair yesterday, I put in our new hair curling oil. And I also put in the 18th century pomade. So it's probably got really good curl to it. You know, the question is, uh, just using the bellows, how well is the powder going to actually stick versus the way that I like to powder my hair with, um, you know, like the individual pieces and kind of putting the powder on like that. But so let me show you the bellows here. Um, so this is my bellows. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> so it does work. And, um, we're gonna attempt that and just don't really have a place to show you guys yet um, the process of it. You'll just have to <laughs> imagine um, powder everywhere. So, um, okay, so I'm gonna get dressed so we can get up on the road and we're gonna get the hair powdered. Uh, so it's one less thing I have to do while we're there. And I'm gonna get some makeup on. I was messing around with some historical recipes and um, successfully um, darkened my eyebrows the historical 18th century way. So um, I'm working on that for you guys too. And we're gonna have some new pomades coming out as well 18th century wise. Um, it's gonna be bergamot and lavender. We took a vote on the website. Those are actual historical 18th century um, scented pomades for the hair. So um, stay tuned and hopefully we'll show you what it looks like right before we leave. Um, as any theater person knows, um, and historical people should know too, when they're getting their hair done, um, it's really important that they use like like a, a zippy um, shirt or a shirt that buttons down because you don't want to have to take stuff over your head. So um, all is good. And this is how my hair is done. I slept on it and I didn't sleep with a mamushka this time. So um, it probably needs a little bit of touch up with the curling iron. But um, I'm going to get some coffee and maybe some Twix as you can see in the background and we're going to go at it. So okay, we'll see you guys in a little bit. So I just wanted to show you guys what I look like without the powder. Um, pretty much Um, the curls, you know, there's four curls on each side with just a higher top. Um, so, and then the back, 
because it's it's still pretty short yet I just kind of took and spread those curls out in the back and I just foof this top up so um, here you go and we're gonna go powder So we're back from powdering, um, and I have red hair, so I think it looks pretty awesome. Um, and it actually, it's a little bit lighter, it's kind of dark in here to tell, but I think it looks really awesome. And uh, the bellows, they worked okay, but the powder puffs, which you can get in the store, work awesome. have mine to show you right now but I'll show you later I took a um, and made a handle on my powder puff to make it easier to um, powder my hair it worked spectacular. so um, this is about it and uh, we're gonna get ready and we're gonna jump in the car and I'm gonna do makeup on the way because that's how I roll and um, we'll see you guys later hopefully with some really awesome photos Bye.